Good morning, Lincoln Soda 2, Cooley Montessori. Happy Wednesday. It's October 4th. It's a day for today. Ninth Street Connection Show Choir will rehearse today from 4 to 5.30. Please talk to Ms. Freeze if you have any questions. FCCLA will meet tomorrow after school to plan the fall fun meeting for October 25th. FBLA will be meeting today after school in Mrs. Enright's room, room 208, second floor computer lab. Uh, be sure to have proper pickup times scheduled with parents. This week's PBIS message. Think about the impact you had on another person by smiling and greeting them. I hope you all have had the chance to give and receive a special greeting. Keep it up and keep the good smiles coming. Last night, uh, some sporting events happening. Our football teams were in action. Uh, seventh grade uh, played hard against Winona Middle School yesterday. Uh, Daniel played hard, recovered a fumble. Um, Cornell stepped in his quarterback and ran the ball, scored a touchdown last night. Uh, keep up the good work, Cougars. Next game is Monday against Longfellow. Uh, okay, Lincoln students and staff, come on, congratulate those girls tennis players. Truly, they are the best. They're undefeated so far this year. Uh, they are inching closer and closer to achieving that uh, end of the season conference championship. Uh, Lincoln defeated Longfellow by a score of 5-0. Singles winners included Kayla Holman, Sydney Roswell, Sophie Hannum, and doubles winners included Elsa Hirsch and Lauren Jarrett, and Nora Hofflin and Ingrid Trapp. Congratulations to our girls' tennis team. Keep up the good work. Uh, Lincoln 7th grade volleyball played their best, best volleyball of the year to this point. Uh, the team won three games. Tremendous serving and communication on the court. Players of the night included Ava Scholl. Katie Trissoni, who actually made a basket on one of the side courts with a tough hit. Well, that's an accomplishment. Nice job, Katie. And Eliana Wicks. Good job, seventh grade. Uh, in eighth grade, hey, a thanks goes out to all the fans that came to support the eighth grade players. It was exciting to see so many fans out there. Uh, the B team, unfortunately, got swept but played hard. Uh, they worked to set the ball and did a great job communicating. Players of the game were Asia McLeod for super positive attitude. And Emmy, she had a huge spike that brought sheer joy across all the fans that, that saw it. So congratulations. Nice job, Emmy. The A-team also worked hard uh, but came up short. Um, players of the game included Melissa Hawkins, CeCe Bozick, Sydney Lockley, and their endless defensive play working to get the ball up and setting with precision. Nice job. Nice job to our volleyball teams last night. I know our cross-country team was also in action last night. Uh, those results are being tallied today. We'll get those on the announcements tomorrow. Uh, and we'll look for those 8th grade football um, results as well. Hey, want to wish everybody a, a happy Wednesday. Have a great day. Be good to each other. Thank you.